looks like we're gonna get some rain. It's about four in the afternoon on Sunday, uh, 5th of April, 2020. This came out of uh, nowhere very quickly. Nice cool breeze. Some thunder. Hmm. A lot of moisture in the air. Rainy season usually starts around late April, early May. So hopefully we'll get an early dose of it anyway. Love the rain. Boy, does that feel good. Good afternoon. It's Sunday, the 5th of April, 2015. I'm Mark, and this is the second of my trying to stay sane in Phuket during the time of COVID-19 lockdown reports. Uh, we just had a 30-minute nice cooling uh, rain shower over northern Phuket town, which really cooled things off. Rainy season usually begins so late April, early May, and most of the early uh, storms, maybe five, ten minutes, so we were really lucky with a 30 minute storm today. Uh, today was actually the first since, uh, well, basically starting self-isolation back on March 18th that I've really had a chance to kind of enjoy <laughs> uh, uh, the solitude, as you will. Uh, remained off social media for most of the day. Uh, woke up very early and decided my goal for philatelicpursuits.com today would be to uh, get caught up on the various uh, Europa issues for this year that I have not yet uh, covered and that have uh, had uh, designs announced. Now uh, Europa is an annual kind of joint issue by countries who are members of what's now called post-Europe. Uh, used to be uh, the European Community of Post and Telecommunications, and they've done annual issues since uh, 1957, I believe. Uh, it's been post-Europe since 1993, and uh, they have a common theme every year. This year is ancient postal routes, which is a uh, subject near and dear to my own interests. So uh, I've been very pleased with a lot of the designs. So I did maybe 10 or 11 uh, different posts today on, on different new issues for the website. Uh, there isn't a bad uh, design in the bunch yet, but that took uh, care of most of my morning uh, into about midday. And I uh, spent uh, the rest of the afternoon relaxing, just enjoying not doing anything. I spent about 30 minutes just getting caught up on Facebook and uh, Twitter just to see if anything major had happened. And the only real news for today is that uh, Batong is now completely locked down. 
Uh, there's uh, police checkpoints at each of the three uh, entrances into the town. Nobody can enter or exit without uh, a darn good reason, which is probably pretty good for the residents of Patong and for the residents uh, uh, from neighboring towns that, uh, you know, can't, I don't know why they would want to go in there anyway. Okay, uh, stay home. But uh, that's the latest news. Uh, nothing else really going on. Nice relaxing day. And I hope there's many more of those. Uh, we're probably going to be under this situation at least until 30 April. Okay, take care and I'll talk to you again very soon.